Trying to get a few, um, a few shots. shots here and there, you know. Oh, all right, okay. Didn't mind me throwing you, did you? No, no, it's okay. No. It was the right thing to do, I think. <laughs> you seem to cover everything else, don't you? <laughs> we do, don't we? Well, if I got the band doing a little short bit on here today. Yeah. And then there's half a dozen of them dressing up as soldiers coming ashore from Dunkirk. Oh, right, yeah. So I thought it'd be nice for you to to film the filmers <laughs> <laughs> doing that. You know, and at nine o'clock he hadn't turned up. Up past nine, he said, I've driven from Croydon to here. All the way down it was snowing. Yeah. I got to Battle, it stopped snowing. I got to the ridge and it was rain. And I got back to in Hastings Old Town and it's dry. You know, Amazing, what a difference, eh? Hey? Hang on, Les, I'll give you a hand with that. Keep it 
Well, what's the point of putting out there when I've got them there? Because people are talking about their work. Yeah, I know. <laughs> 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 Would you believe, Ken, this morning I left my shop, I come down High Street, and I had that on the top like that. Last thing on oh, the top. Jesus, and I come down. Oh, I know. There's Amber Rudd's security, security men in their police, unmarked police car. Two of them. Sitting in. Is Amber Rudd with her two other security guards and her chauffeur. Then there's Amber Rudd's car. And then behind it, there's another police car, security men in there. I got past the first one, and he looked, and he picked up his radio like that. I got to the second one, and he jumped out, and he went, stop. <laughs> he said, where are you going with that? Who are you? Have you got any idea on you? I said, I've got no idea on me. Brian Foster went past. He said, morning, D-Day. I said, that's who I am, D-Day. So he said, but you've got no idea, and you're carrying a gun. I said, I oh, know, I'm not a terrorist, I'm the village idiot. <laughs> <laughs> so he said, what are you doing? I said, we're filming over the beach today. I said, and I'm taking this stuff down. I said, for this, the ghost of Dunkirk. He said, you've got no ID with you. You're walking around the old town of Hastings with a gun. To our point of view, it's a security breach. I said, I don't believe this. I said, but we're looking for people like you today to dress up over the beach as soldiers. <laughs> He said, we can't do anything like that. He said, we're waiting for her to come out. He said, anyway, he said, go on, where you go. He said, you'll be okay. So I nearly got arrested because of that man this morning. <laughs> yeah, but you didn't sell him any bloody tickets. <laughs> I couldn't sell anything to anyone. You <laughs> Bruce, you might need them to... Uh... Right, I'm going to go. When I'm going to dump this right in my van. Yep. And then we're going out to see if we can raise some funds. Yep. You've got me into the back hall <laughs> park. Careful, P.I. I don't want you to break the leg before. I'll rule a solo, then our plank for the closer. Yeah, is that alright? Yeah, no yeah, worries. Give you 10 minutes to warm up. Yeah, you come all around here. Yeah. Yeah. Before we feel. Oh, yeah. Just wait. We just talked about it on the staff. No, that's what we're talking about. Wait, stop. Okay. Just there. Oh, oh go on. You should have shouted. Right, no problem. Charlie? Yeah. Yeah, 
Towards Hastings Pier, and you see a big sort of uh, tight load of tarpaulin scaffolding up. We're in, we're in there. Okay, mate. Solos, the instrumental solo, you know, they go into the end. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Is that true? You tried to assassinate Amber Rudd this morning? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm rested for you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. He's got one in. 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 He's got one Oh, did a shirt all the way.
Try to stop, too close together. A little bit more staggered rather than single line. Yeah. So not straight line, more staggered if it is. we can use next slide do you want to stand in the round with the tees yeah like one yeah like a group and okay then, and then we might be able to do that with some of the soldiers the new soldiers we take it on have you got well got that yeah sure they need Done all that the mug. I've got about three. Got three as well. I would not like that. What about bring it, bring the camera closer? Can we all be talking to some of it? Uh, maybe somebody sat on the edge. No, it's a weird angle. Yeah. Where, what's a good angle that you can see everybody got next to Jake? Yeah. Because you don't have to see the faces. It doesn't I can't see, I can't see similar. Very good. Okay. Get close to Jake. Get close to Jake. <laughs> you're rolling, have a laugh. Now turn around to me and go, cheers. Smile. Oh, sorry, didn't hear. They've been nice and loud. <laughs> <laughs> See me, and you need to get a bit closer to Jay. What about like that? Because I just. She's the same. 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 That's what, the only reason I use green is when it comes in close. It's behind your ear, Jim. Cameras rolling. And action. Action. Germans were the same. Turn. Cheers. Michael, allow me to never employ you as a director for something that was just what feeling. So what guys, thank you very much. Yeah, well.
it's wonderful to bring the history back to Hastings. And another so this is history in the making. We've gone back to a 1931 boat that arrived on Hastings Beach that was paid for by your family yes. many, many, yeah. many years ago. And I moved to Hastings the week that the lifeboat was brought same back time. here, the same week. Oh, wow! Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my God! Very, yeah. very important. Yeah. Very important. Thank you very much for coming along and supporting uh, our efforts to raise some money. Um, so uh, give yourself a big hand. Give your own voice to some of you. We've done this, put this together as a sort of an ind independent thing. Um, at the end of the day, we just wanted to present D Day with a few thousand quid. So uh, if you buy a few DVDs. <laughs> And, uh, and a couple of prints, I'd be really over the moon. Anyway, without further ado, let me just introduce to you the one and only Jonathan Mendenhall. Thank <laughs> you. 
Lay down. 
the last post or the ghost of 